So what does sec x look like? So sec is 1 over cosine. And so if we sketch cosine first, and once again, we're going to go from 0 to 2 pi. OK, so here is cosine. There's 2 pi. There's 0. This point is 1. The minimum point is minus 1. OK, uh, that point is pi. That's pi over 2. And that's 3 pi over 2. OK, so let's see what... Uh, 1 over cos must look like. What does sec look like? So when cosine is 0, um, co well, sorry, when we have cos of 0, then we get 1. So we have 1 over 1, and so the curve must go through that point. And when x is pi, we have cos of pi is minus 1. So 1 over minus 1 is minus 1. So it must go through that point. And cos of 2 pi is 1, so 1 over 1 must be 1. And so the curve must go through that point. When cosine is 0, so at pi over 2 and 3 pi over 2, we must have 1 over 0, so we have asymptotic behaviour there. So we have asymptotes at pi over 2 and 3 pi over 2. And so now we can flesh out the curve because the curve must look something like this. So it's a translation of cosec, like cosine is a translation of sine. So it is, it's been shifted along the x-axis. Well, you could see it that way or that way. Okay? So compare this with the previous graph in the previous video.